Hi guys, Troy from the do-it-yourself world and the off-grid project. Um, went to the doctor today. I um, fortunately don't have any, she couldn't find any any rips in the ligaments, but she found, um, what, what do you call it, stretched, they've been stretched in my knee. And so I guess there's good and bad of that. The, she said that a actual torn ligament hurts less than what I've got and heals faster after while well, you require an operation or something like that I guess I don't know but she said this takes I have to keep stay off my feet my leg for two weeks I'm on a homestead <laughs> and it's gonna take three to four weeks total to heal up now I've got a wrap on it it's got I've got a compression band on it that keeps pressure on it and I'm supposed to keep ice on it so, um, I, oops, I bet YouTube bans this video for advertising. Mm. We'll have to see. Anyway, so, um, let's play it by ear and see what we find to do in the next days. I, um, have some ideas for projects. I hope to keep it interesting and entertaining. I'm not going to have a bunch of sit-down talks like this, except for to tell you that I was at the doctor today, spent a good half the day, um, dealing with that and then I um, attempted to take a nap because the pain was so bad the last two nights I couldn't sleep. Today is Monday so I obviously there were closed most of Saturday and all day Sunday and uh, I hadn't been sleeping so I got right in there this morning. So that reduces I just got on a roll again I just got going I was gonna do all the videos like back in the old days and this happens but I guess that's life you know I'm not sure exactly what twisted it or tore it I did not tore it but stretched the ligaments but it's pretty pretty bad it's really swollen up and I don't wanna be too long here I just wanted to tell you what's going on so I'm either not going to do a video each day or I'm going to do something fun. Uh, I'm not going to bore you. So we'll see how it goes, but stay tuned. Check in every day and see what I may or may not have done. See if we can find some projects you know, around the homestead that I can do sitting. Maybe do some woodworking and I'm pretty sure if I can uh, find a way to get myself across the yard, I'll probably be working on the electronics and uh, the wood shops so might w try to spend some days out there and get some good work done and maybe a lot of videos and uh, maybe fine-tune my solar there we go people are asking me about my solar power so um, I'm gonna take a note of that as soon as I finish this chat and we'll give you an overview of the solar panels and the solar power how it's working how I consider that we're 90 95 percent off the grid I'll explain all that in detail. I'll go over the wood shop and explain the solar panels and the, and the power and the entire system and show you what kind of stats we've been having out there. And I'll be honest, I don't even check it myself. I have no worries at all out there. We have more sun than we ever had in New York. So, uh, this one is called Girly Cat. It just happened to be what we called her. That's the Girly Cat. She's really, really, really soft. Um, I think she was, maybe I can only guess, maybe she was beat in an earlier life. And her, her kid stages, maybe kids had been teasing her, torturing her. Because for a while there, when I would reach to pet her, she'd cringe. But uh, now she loves me. It's cute, she'll cry and start running up to me. And asking for loving. It's really cute. So we're getting uh we're bonding really nicely here. Baby cat's hiding because I got my clothes hanging on the handrail of these stairs. Um, if I need to go outdoors for anything, which I'm not supposed to be moving, but I've got my jackets right there. I grab them and go, and everything is for ease of of you know quick grab and go. I'm gonna try my best to stay off my leg, but 
see how it goes. Yesterday a chicken got out and it would have made a comedy video. It's too bad I didn't have a camera going or third person to run around and follow us. I took my garden hoe and I used it as a crutch and I put my foot on the, the flat part of the hole and I was running across the yard with the garden hoe and my foot on that chasing a chicken. Melanie was going one way and I was going the other so we could catch it and get it put away. That was hilarious. I'm sure it looked hilarious. Anyway, I'll get this video up to you for the morning, so this will be what you see in the morning. And I've already got a, a cool idea and project that I'll have prepared for you. So we'll try to keep it fun. Um, by the way, we're Melanie and I are going to do the sit down for the Patreon site. I want to at least do two, if not four, extra videos a month. And since I've been sort of out of it for a week because of this, um, you know, we haven't done a lot in the last seven days. Anyway, I'm going to work on the websites and the computers and going through my old videos and updating and modifying them to fit YouTube's new standard. I don't think it's fair that YouTube changes everything after years and said, if you don't do it this way, we're not going to show your videos. And it says, you've got to change all your videos. I've got 2,000 videos. So, it is the perfect time for that. Got the big screen up, I got the remote keyboard and mouse, and I'm just going to sit back and plug away. Alright guys, I'll talk to you later. Try from the do-it-yourself world and the off-grid project. Check out Patreon, I'll put the link down below. And uh, watch for the special content coming up. Talk to you later.